Voicemail again. Yeah, get that done, yeah? Phil. Gran? I said, hang on, love. Have you heard me? Well, what do you want me to do? He's a big boy, isn't he? Who? Hey, my dad. Oh, dear, my head. It's killing me. Are you all right, darling? You're looking a bit peaky. Yeah, he's fine, isn't you? Boy, pause off, three. Uh, oh, dear. Give me strength. It won't, my fault. No, no, it never is, is it? How come Ben never gets into a mess like you? Come on, Ben. Hate that. Build your strength up, eh? So can I have it? Have what? Ooh, something died in here. The money from my school trip. I gave it to you last week. But my dad said if I need any more... What have I told you, young lady, about telling lies? But I didn't. <sighs> When's my dad coming back? Oh, soon, we hope. Where is he? Oh, dear. What's this? What? What is it? Ooh, it's all wet. That's not mine. It's Ben's. Are you happy now? You are having a laugh, ain't you? There's an H in Beckham. Give it here. <laughs> oh, whatever. What the? Oh, much obliged, sweetheart. Oi! Well, as long as I don't have to foot the bill as usual. Which reminds me. Surprise. What's that? What's it look like? It's your dirty washing, dear hearts. Which Pat, for one, is sick and tired of picking up off the bathroom floor, and I, for one, am not doing. Guess what? We quit. Enjoy. Dream on. Oh, go on, sis. No, I did it last time. Oh. That is ding, that is... That is minging. No wonder you can't score. Hey, who said I can't score? Lost your magic touch, have we? No, I'm, I'm recharging, ain't I? Then again, that your secret weapon, is it? <laughs> Jingle bells. <laughs> Come on, Ben, open the door, please. Now, do you want me to break the door down, eh? Look, it's no big deal. I even used to do it when I was a kid. What if people find out? What? Find out what? That I lied about Freddy. I mean, if I just tell someone... No, hold up. We're not going to tell anybody anything. Because it was an accident. It weren't your fault, and that's all there is to it, right? Courtney! And you don't want to go raking all that up again, do you? Phil! Oh, Freddy's all right, isn't he? He's coming home today, so, so everything's sorted out. There's, there's nothing for you to worry about. Phil! So that's that, yeah? Yeah? Good man. Oh, an early grow. That's what I'm heading for today. What's up, now? Courtney, I can't find her anywhere. Why can't she stay out of trouble like you, darling, eh? I'm leaving this all right. No, I know what you mean. I was up and downstairs all night myself worrying about Dorothy, huh? Are you having that bit of... No, of course not. It's just that she's my little girl, Jim, and I just can't let her go like that. No. Perhaps she'll come round. But then again, if she's anything like Dorothy, nothing will change her mind. Of course, that son of hers, Nick, he don't deserve her. And I wish she'd give us a ring, let us know she's all right. Cup of tea, please, Jane. Take away. Thanks. I better make a move. Oh. Hey, they're coming home today, aren't they? Yeah. Yeah, they are. They are, aren't they? Poor bloke's gutted, isn't he? Gutted? Why? Well, she's only decided to leave Wolford, hasn't she? Who? Oh, she? Little Mo! And she ain't hanging about with it, either. Fifty pence, please. Oh, sorry, yeah. After everything that's happened, you can hardly blame her, can you? She won't be needing that, thanks. 
I bet Ben can have one. Oh, yeah, listen. Yeah, yeah, well, why don't you get them both one, mate? Save yourself the grief. Well, I ain't going in no car with a baby. I'll walk. Don't you push it, right? Uh, is there none of them about? Yeah, some kind of Slater family crisis. Ben. You all right, mate? Yeah, of course he is. Why shouldn't he be? Maybe he needs a loo. Come on. Come on, you two. How about you, Doctor? You into football? Um, I've never really thought about it. Nah, but I bet you are into football. Well, Yeah, I... well, look who signed this one, yeah? Bowls, you'll pick one up now, cos we're all going to be gone by lunchtime. Babes, I swear I never saw anything on Friday. Not that I can remember anyway. It's OK, Billy, you can stop now. And what colour was it? Lilac or something? Listen, I just have to face it. It was a really nice idea wearing my mum's dress, but it just wasn't meant to be, that's all. What is it? What are you talking about? You know, it's funny, really. Whenever something good happens, him upstairs has something to say about it, and the whole thing goes belly up again. You come in? We're home! No! <sighs> you took your time, didn't you? Oh, you cheeky monkey. You give us such a fright. Here, give us that. No, no, no. It's all right, really. Come and have a cup of tea. We need to celebrate. Too right. Nice to be home, eh, love? Yeah. Oh, Lord, darling. I didn't like to say, but that dress was never going to fit. Well, not with that bump. Come to think of it, you could use it for the baby. <laughs> Becky, it'd be way too big for the baby. No, I didn't mean that. All the fun. Well? Nothing. Oh, he's gone. I know it is. He's lost his mobile, he's got himself into trouble, and We now do not we... have the caller's number. <gasps> I'm sick of this. What are we going to tell Courtney? She's running riot. Uh, where are you going? I'll see if I can find anything out. All this aggravation she's causing, it's no good for Ben. Ben should see a doctor if you ask me. I'll leave off, ma'am. I've got eyes in my head. He's not been right all weekend. And wet in the bed it is, age. I can handle it, OK? Yes, I'm sure you can, but sometimes... No, uh, sometimes nothing. He's had enough people pulling and pushing him around already. Look, all I'm saying is... Yeah, and all is... I'm saying is I'm not having anybody else sticking their nose in our business. End off. Oh, now what? Oh, Peggy, you are a genius. Am I? Use it for the baby. Well, that's what I'm going to do. I'll use it for the baby's christening gown. Oh, that is great. Yeah, well, we'll speak later. OK, yeah, I've got to go. All right, bye. What's all this? Just getting a few things together. Where's Freddy? He's down for his nap. Ah, right, I'll put this up later. Don't want people saying this ain't a safe house for a toddler, do we? Dad, listen. Here, have a look at this beauty. I've got free tea. I, uh. I forgot the spuds, move. Well, you're a great help, aren't you? Well, you best get out and get some. No, I'll tell you what, it's all right, I'll go. No, you stay here, love. Put your feet up, eh? No, uh, I need some air anyway. So what are you saying? He took off because of me? What are you saying he didn't? Listen, whatever your brother's going through... Look, never mind all that. I've got a nine-year-old girl at home who's going up the wall because her old man's gone able. Look, I... And Ben's getting all messed up again just as he's starting to get settled. Is that what you want? Phil, really? I ain't got a clue. Don't give me that. Look, if it was you that was calling him, he'd pick up his phone, wouldn't he? Well, wouldn't he? It's best for everyone if I stay out of this. Oh, what, so you can go back to playing happy families with Mr Bean? Right. Go on, then. If you're so sure. Happy now? Yeah. Right, I'll be straight there. Oh, no. Any chance of a service, Wash? I ain't now early in the morning, so the poppy doctor's cup to the Greek geezer. You can't get him out the cover door of his shift. Uh, right, which one is it, Sam? Give us a break here, will you? Yeah, I'll move out the way I have away with these. Because I want to get these neck curtains done for Dorothy while she's away sorting out her sand. So. It's usually the spin cycle, yeah? Oh, oh no. You know what, there? Well, they're all taken. My mum's going to kill me. I want to get the place looking nice for her when she gets back, see? Go on, have mine. Are you sure? Yeah, quick, before I change your mind. Ah. Uh.
street and mean, keep them keen. Oh. Hang on, hang on. Here, hey, I've seen you before, haven't I? You're a calf. May I have? Yeah, third time lucky. Meet me in the Vic, lunchtime. That's it, if mummy will let you out. She'll let me out, all right. Good. I'm Dino. Might see you later, Dino. Uh, uh, right, uh, uh. Yeah, 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 I sussed out the problem. Yeah. My thing is, there's not enough washing in there. Oh. So I'm going to chuck in some of mine, all right? All right. <laughs> also, switching it on at the plug might help. Oh, all right, yeah. Yes, thanks, you're a good lad. It's all very much, thank you. Oh, so they let you bring him home, then? Well, I hope you're happy. What? My Ben's ill because of you. He's a bag of nerves. Look, I'll, I'll just... save it. Just stay away from us. The less we see of you, the better. You'll be pleased to know that I won't be around here for much longer. Is that right? Yes. I'm moving. Moving out of Walford. Good. Because no one wants you around here anymore. Sorry. Hi there. Well, were you not expecting me? We've got a visit today. Good luck. You're going to need it. Nice to see someone still keeping an eye on her. Shall we go to the house? So, it's going to be a themed wedding. I'm so excited. <laughs> Fantasy themed wedding come true. Oh, dear. <laughs> Does Billy know about this, then? You know, I can't wait to see Billy's face when his outfit arrives. Outfit? Yeah. <laughs> I'll see you later. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, um, 50 pence, please. Hey, you're looking everywhere, are you? Oh, you're so sweet. Peggy sent me over to put my feet up with a cup of tea. Well, it's done a trick. Put it right up, haven't you? Yeah. What's that? Uh, it's a surprise. You'll just have to wait. <laughs> what? <laughs> Honey, wait up. So, in terms of your future plans... Well, what plans? Well, for example, are you going to go back to work? Oh, yes, I think so. And you feel well enough to do that? Well, how do you mean? Well, you know, it might be better to take things one step at a time, not rush into anything. Well, ain't that my decision? Well, of course. We just want to be kept in the loop, yeah? Look, I haven't decided anything, but you could always tag me, cos I've heard that works quite well. What's all this? Just some information. Counselling, group therapy, family therapy. Look, thanks all the same, but I don't think Look, I'm going to be needed. you've been through a very difficult experience, you and Freddie. We're just trying to help, you know? Keep a close eye on you. OK, can you have something else? Only the barrel's run out and it looks like Phil's gone and left me stranded. I'll have a scotch then. Kids, eh? Who'd have them? Yeah, and they're not just for Christmas and all. Mm. Oh, jeez. Mine's an off. Oh, here we go. You just wait till you see her. That is all I'm saying. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle bells. Jingle bells? What's up with you? It's May. Hello? Oh, hello there. Hey, put that away. My usual whatever they're having. Oh, you must have picked something up from your old dad then. You know I hate surprises. Well, you can carry on until the cows go blue in the face. I just have to wait. It'll be worth it. So where is she then? Are well, you waiting for someone? Yeah, so he says. Yeah, Dino, I just see some girl checking out your stall just now. Ah, nice knowing you. For him. In a school uniform, big glasses. Mm. <laughs> just now, she wanted us all out of the house. Won't even talk about it. Yeah, well, if she's doing it for the kid, there'll be no stopping her, will there? They're back then, Charlie. Uh, yeah. She'll only pay for later. Uh, maybe not today, eh? Jim? Guess who's on the phone? Uh, Dot. Oh, my Dorothy. She said she figured out you'd be setting up home here. Oh, dear. I'll never hear the end of this, will I? Oh, it's you. What do you want? Moving? Who told you? Got it straight from the horse's mouth. And it can't come too soon for my liking. When I think what she's put our Ben through... Yeah, where's she gonna go, eh? Somewhere where no one knows or I shouldn't wonder. I tell you, it's little Freddie who I feel sorry for. Come on, Peggy. Especially when you think how that poor little baby was conceived. Wasn't a good beginning. Uh, well, she's been to see Nick. Yeah. What a wonderful woman she is, eh? She got to the ends of the earth for that no-good son of hers. Where's Charlie? Well, he was here a minute ago. Oh, upstairs. Now. Yeah? 
and this is the official fan club magazine. Look. That uh, must be some kind of mistake. I it's... don't think so. This isn't his signature. <sighs> Come off it. I want my money back. Sorry. Right, uh, have you got a receipt? A receipt? You ain't given me a receipt. Ah, no receipt, no can do. I'm sorry, kid. My boss will have me. Your boss? Yeah. Well, maybe the market inspector should have a word with your boss. What? That's Winston! Wait, hang on! I'll, I'll give you another one, free of charge! What? When did that to her? Come here. Yeah, and it really hurts. Oh, you'll live. I didn't do nothing, Gwen, and now we've both been nothing. said Nothing. Little home. Mary Poppins has been running around telling everyone that he will be back in nappies. Oh, what are you like? I give up on you. Me? He's the one. Yeah, we shouldn't be winding him up, should you? He'll chip off the old block, you. Told you he was looking off colour today, didn't I? But listen! Oh, darling, has something happened? What's that Maureen Slater been saying to you now? Mum, Mum, leave him, yeah. Well, she made his life in misery, didn't she? Mum! Still, we won't have to put up with her for much longer. She's moving on. She's what? Leaving. Good riddance, that's what I say. Ben, you all right? Oh, look at him, darling. He's not right. Here we go. I'm warning you. But he's just pretending. Ben, what's the matter, son? What's the matter? It's my tummy. My tummy hurts. Barnstable? What's wrong with Barnstable? But who is this woman, anyway? I told you, Dad, she's a friend of Lynn's. She's opening up a coffee shop and I'm going to manage it. Here we go, sweetheart. But Lynn, she never mentioned it. Now, hang on, where are you off to now? Well, I do need to get some bits and pieces. Dad, I know what I am doing. But you don't know this woman from Adam. Then I will get to know her. <sighs> Dad, it is a great opportunity. I am not going to let it pass me by. Here you go. What's this? The train times. Are they the ones you meant? Yes, thanks. Train times? She was just doing what I asked her. Dad, I am not hanging about. Just a minute. Look, can we just no. talk about it? Dad. I have made my decision, and I am not stopping. Why don't we talk about this later, OK? I'm sorry. Feeling better? What you got there? Put a telly on for you. Son, you know, you haven't done anything wrong. Dad? Yeah? Do you think Mum's watching us? You know what, I don't know. But if she was, do you know what I reckon she'd say? Hmm? She'd say accidents happen. So let's just try and put the past few weeks behind us and, and get back to normal as soon as we can, eh? But Mum used to say the truth will always come out. And this is tried... so good of you, Doctor. It really is. Oh, it's no problem. What's going on? Oh, Ben, darling. Look who's come to see you. Hello, Ben. He's fine. Phil. Right, well, um, let's just take a little look, shall we? Ben, here, here. Why are you being like this? What? Because I don't want your dodgy football. Wait, but I was trying to, you know... Do you really think you're something, don't you? You signed all of them. Didn't you? Right, listen, right, listen. Have the football, right? Okay? And your money back as well. Too late. Keep the money. You'll need it when your licence gets taken. You keep that and all. What? What do you think you're doing? No, 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 no. I was. I was the. Uh, do you live around there? You know him. What, you know her? Of course I do. She's my little sister. Where are those paracetamols? Courtney! Right. Well, there's nothing seriously wrong with you, that's for sure. Of course there ain't. Just feeling a bit under the weather, isn't it, Ben? Physically. Look, Ben, is there something bothering you? Well, not what? Are you sure? Something on your mind that you don't want to talk Look, about? What are you trying to get at? Well, it's just that your mum mentioned... Yeah, well, she's barking up the wrong tree, isn't she? Courtney! Come here! Yeah, cos Ben never does anything wrong, does he? Oh, I've had just about all I can take today. My dad's not here to stick up for me like his. It's not fair! Uh, I'm sorry about this, Doctor. Well, he's gonna be well pleased, isn't he, young lady, to hear what you've been up to when he gets back? Well, he's not coming back cos he hates you all as much as I do. Courtney! My mum is dead too, only I never met her like him. I want my mummy. I want my mum. Now come.
Come on, Freddy, you don't throw rubbish, do ya? <laughs> you better do as your mummy says, and there'll be trouble. No, oh. are you all right? Oh, you all right? No, I can't stop. Hang on. Mate, mate, I was only joking. Mo! Oh, I'm sorry about that. It's, uh, it's just it's been a bit of a day, you know. You've got a good kid up there. Of course I've got a good kid. No, I mean, uh, he really cares about things. Not all kids are like that. He just needs to know that that's okay. Because you wouldn't want it any other way, would you? Mo? Mo! You all right? How do you mean themed? I mean, what outfit? Well, it could be anything, couldn't it? It could be one of those romantic Pride and Prejudice numbers. Oh, I bet you not look good in tights. Tights? <laughs> or it could be like Alice in Wonderland theme. Yeah, you could be the White Rabbit. Yeah, or uh, a Star Wars theme. Come over to the dark side, Billy. <laughs> Honey, um, about this wedding. Now, Billy. I mean, exactly how big is this theme going to be? It is going to be huge. <gasps> it's going to be a Mitchell wedding. Mitchell wedding. What, what's that when he's on? Scottish. You are just going to look so lovely in a kilt. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so there's a, a little flat above the shop and it's got two bedrooms, so, you know, Freddie's going to have his own room. Right. And it's right by the sea. Freddie's going to love it. We're going to have great fun, ain't we? Great. By the way, were you planning on telling me or were you just going to go? Oh, um... Sorry. Sorry, I, I, I don't really have a right. No, no, it's just that, um... Well, I, I hadn't really thought that far ahead, and I, I suppose I... I hadn't decided until just now. You don't have to, you know. Leave. Oh, uh, you think so? Well, you haven't done anything wrong. Yeah, and I'm going to have to spend every single day reminding myself of that. Well, think about it. You know, every time I tell Freddie off, every time he has a tantrum, every time he cries, every time he gets ill or, or gets a little bit on top of me, everyone's going to be watching. I'm, I'm sure it feels like that now, but it's not always Even gonna... if they're not, I'm always going to think they are. You know, keeping a close eye, that's what Matthew said. What kind of life is that? Always looking over your shoulder. I don't think so. And there's nothing that'll make you change your mind? Oh, yeah, sure. A miracle. <laughs> a miracle? Yeah, if you could wave a magic wand and make the last few months disappear. Can you do that, Doctor? beginning to think you've done a runner as well. The, uh, barrel needs changing. Right. Anyway, it's all quiet on the Western Front for now. Well, I'll, I'll be in in a bit. It'll, um, sort itself out, you know. What will? Everything. Courtney, Grant, Ben. We'll get through this. It's not easy being a dad, is it? Mine's a pint, hers is an half. Oh, I would, but at the moment it's just a bit... Oh, right. What happened to the Alan Sugar of Walford? <sighs> Dodgy stock. Told you. Is that what you call it? Oh, there he is. Thanks a million, you. What? Here. Huh? He's only stuck up his washing in with mine, hasn't he? Turn all my neck curtains all pink. Dorothy's gonna go raving mad. You're on your own, mate. <laughs> hey, your program's on the minute. That's uh, Red Planet or Blue Planet, or whatever you call it. Watch it together, if you like. What's that? It's... it's... Give it here, give it here, come on, give it here. Ben, what do you, what do you think you're doing? Well, I thought maybe if I wrote Little Mama a letter. No, 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 no. But I want to tell her, I want to tell her the truth. Look, I thought we agreed not to say anything. Ben! Ben, no! Ben! Ben, calm down! Ben, what do you mean? Come here. Come here, it's all right. Come here, come on. Come on, it's all right. It's all right, mate, come on. Just think about what I'm saying, Dad. 
I mean, Freddie's only little now, but what happens when he grows up? What do you mean? Well, someone is bound to say something at some point. You know what it's like round here? There's always a ghost chasing you about the place. Well, we can tell him. What, and bring it all up again? That's not fair. That's not fair on him. We've got to get away, Dad. You know I'm right, don't you? Yeah. I'm gonna miss you. There's someone here to see you. It was an accident, just an accident. Go on, go on tell her, Ben. It's all right, son. Go on. I'm sorry, Dad. It's okay. Just, just tell her. But it wasn't. What? We were playing horsey, and he got my hair on it, and he pulled it really hard. It hurt, and I wanted to get him off. So. So I hit him. It was me. It was me. I didn't mean to. But I hit him. The one to watch tonight. All made up, nowhere to go. You just can't keep away, can you? New tricks at nine, here on BBC One. BBC One's big on comedy tonight. Lee Evans and his massive XL Tour 2005 Live is at 10.35.